So your man wants to work. Big freaking deal. Takes the pressure off of you. Mm. Yeah, but she's gone back to... Well, you know what she was doing when we first met. She was a teacher, is what you told me. Yeah, yeah, she's a teacher, yeah. I never figured out how a teacher would go marry you. No wonder the schools are fucked if they got women with standards as low as that. Yeah, well, you know, Dave, we met, we fell in love. That's it. Yeah, but a teacher. That's an educated woman there. All that college, all them books she read, that degree she got. For a woman like that stooping down to a guy struggling with the upper reaches of the alphabet. What can I say? To me, it makes no sense. None. I mean, if she was ugly as shit, then you would get it. But even then, a qualified teacher would have to be stomach-turningly disfigured. I mean, to the point of having to wear hood in front of the kids. She would have to be utterly, desperately crapping her looks to crawl down in the sewer and fish you out, boy. Steady on, Dave. But the thing is, your man, she's not, is she? What? Pug ugly. No. Listen, she's not gone back to teaching, Dave. I can't wait she was never a teacher in the first place. Oh, no. What, you mean you never believe me? How stupid do I look, white boy? So what is she, a loop thing? Oh, it's all fucked up, man. It's not right. It's doing me head in. It's legally wed. She's a dancer, see? Oh, a dancer, so that's it. What? What are you saying? Jesus Christ, boy. A girl around here calls herself a dancer. I know what it means. No, bloody no. They earn good money, I mean. The ones that aren't total sad slappers, which obviously your man isn't yet. Boy, your own little wifey working up a sweat, getting those lads' peckers to rise. I mean, how's a guy like you going to pull through that kind of profound public humiliation? Yeah, I hang about, Dave. I mean, life's already given you a damn good whipping. Now you've got to cope with all these blokes waving their dicks in your Mandy's face. Listen, mate, she, she don't actually do nothing. I mean, she don't actually touch them. You can't touch her, neither. Club rules is strictly no touching. Sure, club rules. That's what they tell you, isn't it? Listen, mate, I've seen it. they got signs up at the door. Oh, they've got signs above the door, haven't they? Yeah. It must be all strictly coaching and above board, then, I guess. What are you saying, Dave? What do you reckon? Maybe it ain't. Obviously, a guy like you walks in, a regular greasy John with a slim one, he ain't gonna get the old three courses. All he's gonna get is a little sniff at the main dish, a arse waved in his face or something. No, mate, club rules is for everybody. Look, eye roller walks in, flashes the cash, he gets what he wants. He gets whatever he wants, the old damn deep pan, all he can eat. No, mate, it's not me man dish, he loves me man. What you've got to ask yourself is this, fat boy. How much does she want the money? Or more to the point, how much money does she want? A lot, I guess. Yeah. And all you've got is your shriveled balls and a great big mandy shaped rice. Listen, Deb, my balls ain't shriveled. Give them time. Obviously, there is one way to find out for sure. <clears throat> What's that, then? You go and watch her perform. Find out for yourself what she gets up to. She told me not to. No. So what's she got to hide? Nothing. But she just raised I'll get tortured and fucked up otherwise. Yeah, but you don't go. You still get tortured and fucked up. <laughs> More so because then it's a pure sex-related head fuck, which, as we know, is the most insidious of all the many head fucks known to man. If it was me in your place, I would definitely want to go see what she's up to. You could go. Me? Yeah. See your man dance? Yeah. That way she don't even feel like I'm, I'm checking up on her. You just happen to go to the club. Any luck, she don't even see you. I don't know, Happy. Oh, go on, Dave, please, mate. You put my mind at rest. I know it's a lot to ask. It's desperate measures, Happy. It won't be long term, honestly, once you get yourself sorted out with something. Well, come down to it. This is you saying to me ain't good enough, ain't it? No, it isn't. How's it me saying that? Well, I know it's all my own fault. What, you think I don't know that? Real man provides, pulls his weight. Yeah, but it's all out of date, that way of thinking. Yeah, well, not in my head, it ain't. Good gracious, ass, bodacious, uh, flirtatious, trying to show face. I'm winging for the right time to shoot my steel. You know, winging for the right time to blast them keys. And uh, I'm leaving, please believe in. Straight scotch, the double.
up here. <laughs> Listen, mate, is, it, is she on stage here? Wait, is it is there lots of box here in there? No, mate. She's uh, not even on yet. What's going on with that cheering? Don't panic, Happy. There's nothing going on. Oh shit, Dave, maybe I should just come down there and see for myself. Put my mind at rest, what do you think? What was that? Stop Nothing. Wasting, I got a I'm just feeling a bit sick. What? I'm just Gotta go. Oh. Unless you're gonna do it. Dave! Dave! <sighs> that was amazing. Yeah, it comes like it's on rails, doesn't it? So, um... Is it still not the date? This uh, club belong to you then, does it? Uh, it's one of mine, yeah. How about uh, popping you for a quick drink? Mm. Come on. Glass champagne, celebrate your first time driving a Ferrari. <laughs> All right, then. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't think you'd mind the dancers or I wouldn't have brought you in. I'll get us a drink. Hello, man. Fancy bumping into you like this. Happy sent you to spy on me, did he? Nah. I'm just out for a quiet drink. Doesn't he trust me? What is it he thinks I'm going to do? This what you do for other boys? No, this is special, just for friends of my husband who likes to send to keep tabs on me. Well, you won't find me complaining. Oh, I better won't. You know what a bad boy you are, Dave. Nah, babe. You don't know the half of it. I don't want your money, and neither does my happy. <laughs> Ringing and ringing, Dave. You've got nothing to worry about, Happy. It's a respectable establishment. There's nothing untoward here. Hang on, I'm just going into a tunnel, mate. I might lose you. Mate, no more, Dave. 